The most unusual looking rifle before you is a Lukens air rifle. It was manufactured by Isaiah Lukens of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, sometime between 1800 and 1810. It is a very powerful type of air gun with an interesting history. The Lukens is a buttstock reservoir air gun. The buttstock is unscrewed from the receiver and an air pump, similar to a bicycle pump, is used to fill it with compressed air. It is reattached to the rifle and when the trigger is pulled, a valve releases a charge of air that propels a lead ball through the barrel and toward a target at high velocity. Although the reservoir could contain sufficient air pressure for around 40 shots, the 31 caliber balls were loaded singly through the muzzle. This Lukens air rifle is of particular interest because it is thought to be one of only four surviving air guns of the same type as the one taken on the expedition of discovery by Captain Meriwether Lewis of the historic Lewis and Clark expedition of 1804 to 1806. For many years there was uncertainty about the maker of that rifle, but it has been fairly well established that it was a Lukens. The gun was apparently returned to Isaiah Lukens upon Lewis' death in 1809, and an inventory of the Lukens estate in 1847 cites an air gun that was made for and used by Lewis and Clark in their exploring expeditions. The air gun is mentioned at least 18 times in the journals of the expedition. It seemed to amaze the Native Americans because it fired without the noise and smoke of a black powder rifle. It was also used to kill at least one deer for food for the members of the expedition. The reservoir could be pumped up to about 900 pounds per square inch of pressure and the estimated muzzle velocity of the projectile was probably around 800 feet per second. That's pretty impressive for a 100-year-old forerunner of the BB gun.